<laughs> Interesting. It just two sets, guys. Just working out what um <laughs> what I'm actually doing well right here. Just checking to make sure I am actually live because I've done this a different way, so it doesn't actually come up on my OBS, which is super weird. Hmm. Hmm, <laughs> Right, hold on. Let me, let me just get my shit together here. Right, if I do... This, right, so if I do that... And then... Get rid of that. I'm good to here. And... Go with that and record shot. Apply. That worked? Okay, right, I think I think I've I've sorted that. Okay, good. Um and then the only thing is is I can't actually tell if I'm live on things so like am I actually God, this is really stupid. I mean, it says I'm live. So I'm guessing I'm live. However, I cannot check if I'm live. Which seems a little, little stupid. Oh no, I mean, it does say I'm live, to be fair. Okay, right, cool. <clears throat> cool, okay. Perfecto. You know what I'm going to do though, is because I noticed the last time I was streaming, maybe just a, I'm just a little bit big, a little bit big. Cool. Let's see. Nice. All right, cool. So yeah, I just want to make myself a little bit smaller because, um, yeah, that was bulbous. I was covering like a quarter of the screen. I didn't actually notice that until um, I was watching it. I was just checking to see how that last stream went, make sure the audio and all that was fine. So yeah, anyway, right, let's get into this. So I'm starting like seven minutes early, but shoot me. Now, what we are going to be doing today is just continuing our Carl Franz stream. And yeah, we were in quite an exciting place last time around actually. Because we had just finished the war with Kenmore. Um, again, we were frustrated to a war with the goblins, which we knew was going to happen. And surprisingly, a war hasn't stirred up in the East yet with Festus and Vlad. And the only war that's not concerning me, but the only war which is still to be fought in the West is the war against the Skaven. And that's going to be the challenge. Is us. Um, Deciding whether we push south, finish the game us off. Because if we, if we do that, if we finish off Ikat Claw, so that's what we look at this. if we finish off Ikat Claw down here, it means this entire western front, other than like Norska and Belakar attacking Bring North, which Wunker's kind of got under control now, this is all allies. So we will not need to worry about our western front at all. Our southern front is kind of okay, I think. Um, and we can go and focus on this shitstorm. But, the truth is, is, I mean, we're looking down, like, Carcassonne's in trouble. If we don't help them, Skaven will definitely win. But, I, it's Skaven, isn't it? So, that's going to be a huge, huge body commitment to, like, go down there and deal with that. I think what we've got to do is we've got, let's finish off the green skin. So, let's deal with, retake uh, the river green and the barrels of something. What's that called? Um, the Barrows of Kulux. And then take it from there. And in the meantime, we'll just keep focusing on our economy. I'm not going to build anything just yet, because we'll wait until we've actually cleared the turn. 
I don't think there was anything else major going on, to be honest. We've still got a lot of our quest battles to do, and yeah. Upgrade any settlement to that. We're getting the shield for the strike. So yeah, without further ado, let's get cracking. Now, we were bringing down Oleg Helberg. Um, he's our new commander. Our new general, I should say. And we've got a uh, veteran where he should be, which is kind of like buffing up and managing the kind of economy in the West. So we're going to send him over here, for example, try not to cost of that down. Although, until we get that, which is going to be... I don't know how many turns that is, actually. 90s. Yeah, so it's like 13 turns away. It's not going to have that huge an impact. But yeah, right, we're going to jump into this because I want to just queer these guys off and then... Is that just... Right, so he's taking... Leonis and shut him with Celia. Right. Um, now, I reckon they'll run. Oh, I don't know if they can because they attacked us, remember. They besieged um, Baston. That was what happened. So, yeah, we're just going to take this. Ah, are you actually making me fight this? I can't believe you're making me fight this, but I'm going to fight it. I refuse to lose that one man, so. <laughs> so our first battle of this evening is going to be me stomping on about 12 green skins with about 3,000 of uh, 3,000 troopers. But that's fine, if that's the way Grom wants to play it. So yeah, so this battle should be an absolute wash. I'm probably just going to keep that dude back, to be honest. Because, um, you know, I don't... I'll uh, put him up the top here so I don't get confused. <laughs> It'd be funny if I end up fighting a battle and end up losing the guy anyway. So, yeah, we're going to get rid of him. We will cover up the flags. Put that in the centre. And we're probably not even going to need our second army here. But it's good experience for them. So, um, we'll get the right guard. And our fellow knights on both sides. We're gonna pop these guys out here. And you guys are gonna go up front. More I can just sit here, I guess. And yeah, you can go up there and you can go up front with them. Cool. Right. Just wanna move these guys forward. Because Grom's obviously going to wait for his reinforcements, isn't he? Like, that's what's going to happen just now. Well, let's put him up anyway. My mortar is actually targeting river trolls. Like, what a waste of ammunition. Get the arrow, boys. Um, right, and the rest of the army, might have said, could just start moving up. Yeah, we'll take that out, no problem. I can't really decide whether just to go. I kind of would have just charged the knights in for the banter. Some accurate artillery. Boom. Boom, boom. Good stuff. The one's there is still a minute away. I mean, same as him, to be fair. Well. Right, I'm going to bring Carl a bit further up front. I just want to, if they decide to make a move for it, I just want to be ready for it. Okay, and Carl. Right, so this is gonna be. Oh, where's my dude? Where's my dude? Where's my dude? Where's my dude? No. Ah. Right, move across this side. Right, go block him off. Right, cool. Um. Yeah, we'll pull them back. Knights, go in, crush that. Yeah, just pile in, like, um, dog pile. Probably gonna pop in there if that hits that. Meat. Cool. Yeah, I mean, the army is coming over, their army is coming in. Nice. Is that it where's right guard do it good to be fair? Ah! Oh. <laughs> Never artillery is on point. Jesus. 
Jesus Christ. Hey, cool. Cool. Right, reform. Reform the line. Nice. Right, cool. Let's get our infantry up here, along with God. Um, those hangars took an absolute pounding. You guys are going on a get out of jail free card list. I do not want to lose you. Um, you can move up, I guess. And you guys can move up. I mean, let's be honest, I ain't the knights who are just going to finish this. Carl's still chasing down Grom, which is fine. Oh, you can head across here. Are you still in range by any chance? Ah, oh, he's literally just got out of range. That really sucks. Um, okay, might need to bring these guys across just to figure me that. Pull back. Oh, come on, Carl. Come on. Come on, buddy. Do what you need to do. Um, right, and the Cav can go and jump again. I don't know how important it is actually to kill Grom here, to be fair, but... No, go and get him, for sure. Now, you know what I can't decide, actually, is... I kind of like the idea of Hellberry's army having no magic in him, like him being like an old-school, like, cleric. It's like, that. Nah, you're not magic. So we might do something along that. The problem is, is the faith in it itself isn't quite strong enough. So... Let Grom go, it really doesn't matter. Um, I think you're dead anyway, so. Yeah, I don't even think we need to wrap this up because they're on the retreat. And even if we need to just fight again, I think that's actually better than, um, than, than chasing them all down. Yeah, so I kind of this cool idea of doing, like I said, um, Helberg, like, you know, flagellants, knights, Powder, yeah, sure, but um, it's just faith in steel, no magic. But we'll see. I mean, it, it seems a bit of a shame. The Empire's actually got access to pretty good, well, it's got access to so much different types of magic, so yeah, definitely worth looking into. Um, we'll just take the money. Yeah, dead. Does he run away? No. Nope. Okay. Praise be to Sigma. You got what? Anything good? Probably not. They're both shite. Oh, uh, that one's not actually shite. I'll leave that one. Tradesmen, income from trade, faction wide, for sure. Okay, so. What I'm thinking is we're going to divide and conquer. So, Oleg is going to head here. And Carl is going to head here. Naturally. No peace, just war. And war calls. Um, I mean, we don't have any great sword yet, so it seems like a bit of a waste getting that. We've got a sharpshooter, we've got a standard ground. Let's just keep doing up Carl. Like, um, he needs to get better at fighting. He's a bit of a wimp at the moment. And we've kind of got on a spell to so I think scouting's still the way to go. And again, I'm not going to um, upgrade anything yet. We'll finish this battle first, and then we will move on. Is it actually a settlement battle? Nah, I didn't think it was. And we're just going to do the same. We're just going to weave our wounded guys um, off to the sides. But yeah, I reckon we're probably a turn, maybe two, away from the Goblin Menace in Bretonia being finished. The thing is, I would actually quite like to see Lewin regain that territory like we need um, and stuff like that because he's not much used to me defensively unless he's powerful. You know, I'm kind of planning to use him as a bit of a shield, but yeah, it's um, that's up to Woon, I guess. Not up to us. Yeah, 
plane, plane, and yeah, we'll put them out front. I mean, why the heck, Nay? I'm gonna weave him in the back here just because we got a little bee up at him. I'm complaining about boo boo and stuff. Um, and not you guys. Oh, they're advancing on me. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, orc boar boys, eh? So I think Carl go across and help them win that fight. And you move up. I don't actually know who he's firing at here. Doesn't really matter, do we? Right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna send them there. Them across the side, him across there, and we're just gonna try and get a nice little conquave here. Ah, oh, instead they get the uninterrupted charge off. No. Alright, well, screw the pooch from that, it's fine. We'll get that so it doesn't affect and that. These guys just charge into them. Nice. So damage. Do we draw? Yeah. Nice. Right, just pull back until they are ready. They are gone. across here and just finish these guys off. But nice. Nice. And you guys straight into the back of them. Doing good to me. Okay. So the cavalry will finish dealing with that while we move into position to deal with the next wave. Well, it's the next wave then. The, the bits we've been distracting. It's fine. Uh, yeah, start. Nah, not on the archers because we're just gonna bomb them. Right, broken, broken. Kind of broken. Almost broken. Um, do it that way. Nice. We are my losses. Hey. Cool. Hmm. Ah, nineteen losses will take that. Cool, and you can just take that. Recovery time. Hang on, give me a nice bit of replenishment to go and go off and deal with massive Oracle. That's the reason I'll split my forces because I just want it done. Um, whereas if I go and attack one at a time, everyone will get a chance to build a bit more. I do not want that. Bring me to my men. Okay, do that in a second. You can get there. Okay. Let's just see diplomacy wise what's available to us. Probably I'm sweet no FA. Yes. Yes. Nothing. Fine. No immediate threats I can see on our borders. Praise Sigma. So we've actually got enough to get Outdorf up to the next one. I guess Outdorf is like worth like nothing. But this is gonna be worth a fortune. I will marshal the men. Right, so how much is it just now? Six, um, six, nine, so... It is time let's move up here. The provinces. Right, income from ports, minus construction cost. See, why isn't it... 
Why isn't that affecting it? Do I actually have to be now, in the settlement? The what does the Emperor bid? So is that a bug? Like, what is that? Maybe I need to wait a turn. Right, we'll wait a turn and see if that improves that. Um, what I'll do is, the yeah, we'll wait calls. one turn. Just got to be careful because I don't want to spend the money on something else. Right, that's okay. We can get that. Um, oh, that's gonna come really super close to rebellion. For control, I just want to stop that rebelling um, until we get a grip of what's happening. I'm not gonna fix anything up just yet By the until we know what's going on. But we'll check and see because that's that's annoying me. Like the whole point of me getting him is meant to be like so? it does say minus twenty five percent. It said it as soon as he walked in. So. It'll be interesting to see if this works, because realistically this should be an extra 40% income for the port. But construction time. Oh, it's time! Oh my god! It's time! Oh, what a tube I am! I thought it was cost! The nation calls! <laughs> I've literally, the last two streams, I've been going on about this and going on about this. Oh. Oh. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still a good thing, but... Oh. <laughs> um, and my port is up. They were eight percent. To be fair, all right, cool. Yeah, we're, let's just get out there, fucking good. Oh, I am such a tube, like an actual tube. That is wild. I cannot believe how wrong I got that. Who calls? <laughs> yes, to unite the provinces. Oh me, yeah, that is that is Ready. next level wild, next level. I am Prince cool. and Emperor. Right, um, where's the here? Oh, I'm so embarrassed. Like, I have been planning and scheming around my 50% um, construction reduction. Ah, oh, that's a good word. Construction reduction. Uh, yeah. It's absolute shit. One cast I'm right, here comes the war. Yeah. Bretonia stood behind me. Problem is, he's actually very close to my border, so... Uh. So Nordwin has come under attack from Greenskins in the region of Middenstag and are appealing for you for military assistance. Will you come to their defence and join them in battle or leave them to fight off their attackers alone? Well, I've got a lot of prestige with nothing to do, so yeah, we'll send you support and we'll take the moolash. And Skaven have just defeated Carcassonne, oh my god. I'm going to end up fighting a war in two fronts here. Your orders? I'm enough. I mean, we know who's there. I'm not I'm not sure. I really want to waste the money on it. Um, right, before I do anything else, I just want to see how fucked I am. Okay, so they're at war with the, the Wood Elves. Okay, so no, we're not totally messed up, but we are going to need to assist them. If they just overrun them, I feel like them overrunning the Wood Elves is a distinct possibility. Yes, yes. Still mine. Not mine. Okay. In the name of Magnus. Right. What can you do? You can assault Garrison. Um, I don't know if that's worth it, to be honest. And uh, Belker's taking that. Okay, right, we're going to grab uh, Borderworld just now. I don't have any siege, so unfortunately, I'm going to need to wait one, which sucks. But we will get siege eventually. Cool. Um, now, the thing is, I just don't know what I do here. Right, we'll move him. 
Um, just so we're not. What was my plan? It was Derek Cross here to see if there's anyone to trade with. But the truth is, there's either going to be. Either the High Elves are going to be winning this, or we're just going to introduce ourselves to Dark Elves. Maybe go down that way, to be fair. Right. I kind of need to know what's going on over here, but I can't hire anyone to go and check. I will marshal the men. I think I'm going to delete this, okay? And get a defensive building here. We'll try and hold them at Grumberg until I can get someone across. So yeah, as much as I wanted to spend money on buildings and whatnot, um, yeah, we're going to need to get defenses, sadly. I don't think it's going to be as important here. I, I would actually, I'm more interested, I want to know what is happening over here than what's happened down here. So I'm going to send Hannes to go and check that out. It's going to take two turns for that. And we're moving against um, that. It's going to be a tough little... Um, oh no, it's not going to be a tough little at all. Okay. Um, Just checking something. Um, yeah. So next turn. I mean, we can check diplomacy. I don't think we let you check the last turn. So ah, oh, it was actually worth while. We'll yes, we'll take that. No glory. Yeah, I think. And the thing is, attacking is given. I think what we're doing, we're going to send one army east to go and fight. Um, the, the dead and I'm going to leave Helberg that. here to help push back this game because I feel like if we don't help in this war there is a chance that they could lose it and um, whereas if they win it and not even if they win it our relations will massively improve them for fighting Quang Squire as well so yeah definitely worthwhile right, next turn So yeah, so we're going to need to fight in two theatres, but you know what, it's worth it. Like, I mean, we'll gain territory from this as well. Like, if we can push south and take... Oh, here they come. He's already moving towards Grumberg. Welcome, brothers, from across the Grey Mountain. Oh, I really want to help you, but I am so stretched as it is. I guess it's really going to shit in my parade. <laughs> the loss of Grumberg here. Hey. Yeah, unfortunately, we have to wait one more turn. Is with us. Right. And Carl. I see no other option. Still can't get there. This is my right by Sigmar's crown. Oh well, we still have an exciting last battle. The nation calls. Such oh, that is a that is a hefty little army. It's difficult because he's just gonna be able to run wild across this land. What I might do though is we are we building anything that I can delete? Not really. Apart from that, which I'm not doing that. The Empire We're gonna lose Grumberg, which really really sucks. I mean that's a lot of money. We're gonna lose six hundred and twenty one a turn. Basically gonna nearly bankrupt us. Yes, my what? What does the Emperor bid? Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Prince Eltha. Yep. Hmm. I command. We're just gonna need to suck so it up. Um I think obviously defending Outdoors is the priority. He is probably just gonna run rough shot over his territory. But, um, yeah, we don't really have a choice. We, oh, I forgot about you. Sorry. 
All right, here comes Vlad. Yeah. No point in trying to fight that. So Vlad has come for his throne. Yeah, I thought that was what would happen. To battle. Cool. Yeah, I mean, we don't need to fight that. And take that. Is there resistance income from all the buildings? Okay. Let's Ready. get. I want to put that in him if we can. Yeah. And what is he on now? Income worker buildings up to 12%. I thought I had more, to be honest. And nothing else? I thought it was the liver one that was. Okay, it's not barber, it's not camp for coachman, no entertainer, no hedgehog, no definitely no. <laughs> nah, I think I imagined it. Okay. Yes. We've got to put us back in a positive arc from the Right, um, we're going to delete that. We don't need production here. We do need that, though. And the elector counts. Carl and will friends. take Massa uh, Orca, which we're going to fight. Go! So, the last stand of the green skins in Britonia. Unfortunately, Grom came back, but what can you do? Do, 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 do. Big long walls. I think we're going to go for this side. Oh, there's a lot more. Yeah, I think we're just going to go for this side. I normally go for the other, but honestly, do I don't think did? tactically there's a huge difference. It's the towers, that's the biggest difference in advantage, but. What we're going to do is just place ourselves off to the, the right here and hope that they react and do the same thing and then we will move our cavalry across and take that. Right, nice. Um, these guys are just gonna go and climb some walls, I reckon. And these guys gonna move up to here. And these guys probably not gonna do much. I'm just gonna sit in there. And yeah. Move everyone up. Is that magic? Was that filthy magic? Trying to avoid that, that damage, please. Oh, there he is. Great. I wonder if Carl can be cool and finish this quickly. Oh my god, he fell off! Do you see that? He actually fell off! And now he's down here! That is wild! I've never ever seen that before. I didn't even know that could happen. That is crazy! I did not know that could happen! That is so cool! <laughs> the car just like chucked him off the, the battlement. Uh, Oh, what a sweet. What is that? What? I found that recently with it. It's like you'll give people orders, they'll just stop doing it. Like randomly, I don't know if that's a difficulty thing. Right, get across here. 
off there. God, Carl is such a wet biscuit. Like, what is taking him so long? Okay, cool. Cabot's in. I don't know if I actually have the energy for that. Let's, um, we need to get Edgar now, because, yeah. You guys can come in here, actually. We got guys broken, so what a waste of my time out of here. And you could go and kill that dude. I mean, is it even worth climbing those walls anymore, guys, if we're being honest? We're actually already in, so... I think you guys just come in and attack. Yes, oh. Cav is getting binned a little bit though, as is Carl. Come and help. Uh, no, no, no. I want you to actually go and attack him, not pretend to attack him. Sure we were through here. Yes, we are. Oh. Right, get there. Come on, I just need one. That's beautiful. Yeah, that was good. That was good and tasty. Right, um, we're kind of going to try and buoy Grom now. Right, they're all coming in. Oh, I need to get his cavalry out of here. Come on. Do it. Do it. Right, cool. It's fine. So, cavalry is kind of trying to... <laughs> Get there. It does look like we're now winning that fight. Like they have panicked. They are buggering off. Oh, trolls. For sure. What heresy is this? Why are you running? Again. Do not let him get out. You guys get in. You guys, get up in the battlements, please. And Gunner's up here. Fine. Yeah, one night's broken off, but probably gonna pull. Yeah, they broke it off anyway. So, and all you guys, go and get these trolls. Maybe get Swordsman and him. Is there anyone else? Ah, Grom's. I mean, is he going to turn around though? If we're being honest. Right, shoot. Um, where's the dude? That's, that's who I needed to get after. Yeah, I mean. It's got pear shaped for them now, for sure. Oh, Grom turned around. What was Carl doing? What was he doing? Oh. I need to get him out of there. Oh, it actually makes me sad. Like, um, the... I don't, what would you even call it? Is it path and, like I said, I don't know if it's a difficulty thing, like maybe because I'm on very hard, like maybe it makes these mistakes happen. I honestly don't know, like what the, the, um, the context is, you know? But I do feel like it's a thing, like I, I feel like it's a very conscious thing, or I don't know if it's pathing, because like they played, they played about a mass a lot over the course of this game's development and I just, I don't know, maybe they just not made some good decisions. Yeah, I don't know. Right, um, yeah, 
probably get you guys here. Probably get you guys there. And get something like that. We've got no one else to chase it away. Right, um, the cavalry is just going to keep cleaning up that. These guys could probably head here now. There's not much point in beating the walls, if we're being honest. Grom's. He wouldn't like this, is what I mean. Carl stopped chasing Grom again. This is the second time that he's been given an order to go and attack Grom, and he's just not forwarded his ass. And um, we'll wait until they get down and in. You guys on that. Go and attack them. I don't know what that's meant to mean. Right, fight. So, Carl is such a wet biscuit, he couldn't kill him. But thank you. Thank you to the right guard, which actually did up the job. Got there pretty, pretty battered, aren't they? Pretty battered and bloody. We must form an alliance, but I'll be pretty shit. <laughs> These poor guys are just surrounded by fucking gobos. But anyway, the war is over. I hope my frustration with Carl Franz along with it. I just don't know what his issue is. He's like, I'm the Emperor, you don't tell me what to do. The Centaur's right guard did really well, actually. I mean, be fair, like, a cavalry head, I think, performed pretty well. No one died, so we'll call that a win. Um, I wouldn't unoccupy that. So, that's the Broken Axe tribe gone. I am France. Don't they need that. Happen. Do we need this? Screw it. No. No, nah, because we don't. I, mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, because we're going to build it in Altdorf, aren't we? For being honest. So, that's fine. Right, uh, Marienburg, for sure. We want to get that upgrade. But not. How long would it take to build? One turn. Okay, that could be worth it with one turn. Yes, my lord. Praise Sigma. I'm going to keep him here because I want to protect Altdorf. Sure, we will afford that, but it's fine. Of the right, let's um, definitely hold the line, um, route marcher, because we're going to need to help get back to the front quickly. Um, let's make you more effective at killing, um, more effective at defending yourself. Carl. The nation calls. God, Carl, where to start? Um, just keep working your stat lines. Um, take a scout him. Hmm. Is that a shrimp? Yeah, we'll take that. Cool. Alright, well, I think, like, with this, we're definitely in a reasonable place, so just gonna get there and we've also got this one as well so we'll get growth this is that plate four so i wonder if or do we just keep that in the meantime 
Nah, you know what? Let's just wait and build up a bit, actually. Just for a wee bit. Um, no glory. So yeah, Only they're pretty happy with us because we just um, thumped Grom. So I'm going to give it one more turn and let the relationship bolster even more. And then, yeah, we'll, we'll try and get trade off of them as well. Cool. Oh, I just hope we have enough time for Uber's right to get up and running before Vlad gets there. I mean, just the fact that we'll have the walls and I don't even know if that works anymore, if I'm being honest. It should, but I don't know if it will. Ah, oh, he's going to go for outdoor instead. Okay. This is going to be a toughie. It's actually a good thing though, because if he takes outdoor right now... Oh, not takes outdoor, what am I saying? Like, if he he's attacking outdoor right now, it means we'll be able to go in a counter-offensive and retake our territory quickly. I thought he was going to run around and take everything around outdoor before attacking it. But if he wants to go straight for the Imperial Capital, by all means. Better on Bron the Builder awaits. Now I think one of the most important things this battle is going to be we just need to avoid fighting Vlad. And we have our heroes if we can isolate them, great, but we need to avoid fighting Vlad at all costs. That makes me really sad. <laughs> We're not going to be able to do anything there. You know what, it's one of those things I'm not even sure. Yeah, I'm not even sure what the best way of doing that is. Oh, Bretonia must have built a... Uh, a Duhikima bobber. Graveguard, zombies, graveguard, skeletons. Doesn't seem that big an army, does it? So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. There's three units I can't see. Zombies, graveguard, skeletons. Men. Okay, I think what we're going to do, right, is we're going to put mortars up in this hill. Maybe a little bit closer. Because what our plan is going to be is instead of engaging in there, why don't we just... Now we're going to put that there, for sure, and I'm going to put these guys here. You with me? See what I'm doing? These guys here. Maybe put one there. See what I'm saying? See what I'm doing? And then we're going to put four of these guys here and we're going to let them break in and then we're going to fight them in this choke and here I'm just going to put two up in the, the battlements and um, two ready to defend the gate with them backing them as reinforcements brawn in the cavalry I'm not too sure. Like, I believe it's that side they're going to need to go. But, um, I think for just now... What's Bronn on? Yeah, Bronn's on a horse. I think Bronn and the cavalry just sit in the middle until we decide what we're doing. The other thing I've got to think about as well is, in terms of terrorists, because... I've got enough to take out the chaff, right? The biggest issue is going to be taking out the heroes. So do I build stuff that's going to be better at taking out the heroes or cannon terrors? I think we go for piercing terrors. Because it's not the, the big bulky stuff that I'm actually... Oh, Blood Knights is 
tricky dicky though. No, but we're still gonna defend. Hmm, well, that makes me want to reconsider this bit a little bit. Yeah, we're going to put these guys over if we're going to be, um, I didn't realize we're dealing with Blood Knights here. Cool. Nice. Right, I think we've gotten everything. I've got Pierce and Tower on that side. I will save up and get Pierce and Tower on this side. Pierce and Tower here. Yeah, on those two there. Yeah. Cool. Right, I think we're okay. The only thing that screws up now is the surprise attack at the gate that we weren't expecting. But I've got the cavalry to respond to that if it does come to that. And hopefully the gunners are going to do an absolute number on these guys. Oh, yeah. Where did they go? Oh my god. I like them knocking them all off. That was intense. We are sick of death. Missiles at the ready. Weapons at the ready. Cool. Shields up. And get you, make sure you guys are in that stance. Right, um, it, the mortars aren't going to be particularly effective against that, but... Oh my god. The gunners did not do well, did they? What I want to do is I want to actually run them past them and just jump in the mic up. I'm actually, like, I, I'm feeling the pressure already. Like, I, I genuinely feel like this is um, already going quite badly. Yeah, just um, get off the walls because it's... it's not going well. Not going well on the walls. Alright, let's go for a liver tower. That's good fine there though. Yeah, I think um I think the real issue is gonna be here, so let's get down here and deal with this. Oh, these Vargos are not for giving in. And you guys just try. Okay, here he comes. Let me just try and slow him down, I guess. Yeah, that's good. We're out of one. And we're almost able to get the next terror up. Yeah, Huntsman are so good. So goddamn good. Oh my god, this far guys just give it a rest, like. Die. Like, oh my god, just die. Like, there was literally one left. Like, that is ridiculous. The game is so much better at just shutting stuff down now. Like, it's frustrating at the same time, though, because they do it to the extent of. Yeah. Just kind of drives me nuts a little bit. I um, Stuff that's gonna waste ammunition, I guess. Right, fall back to there so you're you're good to go. Right, see if you can try and take down Isabella. Right, you guys on the grave guard, what's that? That's zombies. Don't waste your ammunition. Just shoot there. Lad is obviously going to win that. Yes, my lord. Eh, good thing with zombies. How are we doing here? 
Okay, um, I... What I think we're going to do, actually, is this side I'm now a little bit worried about. I'm going to send two cavalry contingents up here. And they're going to stay here for just now. Um, go for a cannon tower, screw it. Oh, do I want a cannon tower though? Do I? Obviously, she's just going to try and shut everything down. Okay. What are we doing here? Right. Um, guys, don't want to tell you to do your job, but you probably want to kill that first, if. definitely swinging in our favour. Somehow she has managed to engage three units at once, which is pretty impressive. Gotta love it when that, that happens. And this is the problem. It's taking these two out, which is going to be the absolute nightmare for us. Hmm. Get um, everyone here. I would say this part of the fight is going extremely well, though. Conditions acceptable. But it's just whether we're going to have enough to win out here, you know? Like, oh my god, like, how is he on then? Shoot. Right, you guys get down here, you across here. Right, how is the artillery going? Screw it. Um, go for a graveyard, danger close. Right, go back. Um, keep shooting at those blood knights. Yeah, oh, he's three of Ken. Of course he is. Of course he is. Um, I wonder if Heather would do alright in combat against him. Oh. Like, what's that formation about? I just told them to go over here. I didn't tell them to form this this weird little column that allowed Vlad to just nip at their heels. Oh. Yeah, that actually seems to be pretty effective, so I'm not gonna. Oh, that did hit us though. Yeah, um, try and take out the zombies. How are we doing here? Right. Shoot him, shoot him. For the love of God, shoot him. Nice. Right, get out of there because he's coming for you. You guys just stopped. Look. Why have they stopped? Those guys were also ordered to shoot at her. They just stopped as well? No. Um, we're definitely need army losses to finish this. Alright, red. Alright, go and get over here because um, this is not going well against one. <laughs> I um, have a knight's at realm and those guys over here. This, this fight's over, so. Thankfully. Um, 
Okay, yeah, quick. Right, shoot her. Shooter. It's incredible how easily she these guys are just getting on absolutely every unit. Yes, General. For the Keep pushing. Take the ground. Nice. Okay. Oh my god. Let me guess. Shoot her, I don't care about him. Like, we're not gonna get him. Nice. Nice. Good. Yeah, I think I'm guessing that's Army Walk is kicking in there. But he is Vlad, so he's gonna take a while to die. God, I didn't even think, like, um... <laughs> go and just protect that, just in case. Because I would be... Livid. Livid, I tell you. See, like... They sh oh. Right, actively pursue him. Make his life difficult, for the love of God. Vlad is just such a boss, he's actually healing through his crumbling. Like, it's unreal. Like, he's just such a terrifying opponent. The only way to kill him is to kill his entire army. Even then, Luke, he is actually just healing his way through this fight. Like, this is just unreal. Right, I think he's fine away. Yeah. Oh, my God. But the capital's safe. That's all that matters. Oh, you know what? There was something I was going to check. Yeah, it did work. Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that, look at that. Who knew? Cool. Oh, get that over here. Right, we'll take the money, thank you, as reparations for the damage you caused. Obviously. Why even from Wales? It brings me in succession. No, you haven't. Thank you for playing, but no, you have not. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Right, what... What are we going to do here? Cause I can't take that, unfortunately. I want to, but I can't. So? Hmm. Not too sure. Oh. You know, I might go down the blue line with him. I could do recruitment calls, he could just become a, a recruiter. That could be his job, he could recruit forces first. That is actually a thing. Yeah, you know what, let's do that. And get Quartermaster as well, so while he's recruiting, it's a lot cheaper. Lightning strike, enemy reinforcements times, that'll help during sieges and stuff. 
yeah, let's go down that route. Um, the control, yeah, I think he, he's definitely a blue route guy. Let's go for that recruitment quota. Cost seems crap. That will be a necessary salon. Ironically, yeah, let's do. I've never ever done Weed Over Renown before, but I have a kind of idea in my head that he's going to be sitting somewhere and he can just recruit for us. Right, this war is over. So as much as I want to go and take on Vlad, it is not a thing. It's just not what's about to happen. Now, defensively, Uber's right already pretty well defended. Like, he won't take it here, so I'm going to build... The nation calls. I would really like to get there. I will marshal the men. Yeah, could he take it? Right. He could, because he could well, just um, raise the dead. So, yeah, we're going to build that. Our heart. Uh, maybe not that just now. Okay, so I think mages is obviously something we're going to want. We also want artillery. And we're now in a position to get artillery. So we're definitely going to get that and. Yeah. Why not? Cool. Right, um, we do need to get house. stuff here, which kind of sucks. Let's see if we've got any trade deals no, anymore. Only surface. Alright, you well, have let's just get the non aggression with these guys just now. And then hopefully they'll want a trade of us, because that'll just keep boosting our relations. I wouldn't mind some extra money, so maybe we go for this and just see. Forward in his name. Uh, well, I sealed rations, yeah. I'll take that. My journey begins. I command here. Okay, Bordeaux is also a big port. That's nice. And let's do it. Yeah, we'll definitely get the wine making. Right, Carl, you they need to um, hightail at home. There is something afoot. Try and head to defend Uber's right. This guy here, I think it's too soon to weave, and I actually think I'm going to use him against the Skaven. I'm still determined to fight the war in two fronts. I, I feel like the Skaven need to be pushed back. I do not want to see him get the upper hand. And. Oh my god, are they taking the blade? Yes, General. Right, let's just see what reinforcements he's got coming. Yeah, okay, you see, he's still got quite a bit there. Um, just keep moving around. Looking for trade partners. Just stay where you are. Yeah, it's fine. Right, we should be able to change that back to growth now. Because we're at plus five, so. Nice. I'm going to think you're never going to get your quest Bring battles, friends. We could also help against Bellicker, but... Yeah, yeah, see, Vlad is preparing his main armies now. Just gonna make this tricky dicky. So, Theodric Gauser of Nordwin sends you an invitation to be his personal guest at their annual Worst Fest, an annual harvest time festival in which citizens all across the empire feast and toast the gods. Their land, the empire, and their ancestors, it is a grand gesture for the head of state to extend such an invite to another. So, naturally, you accept. On the day of the worst fest, you are called away to lead an army against a minor uprising. The scuffle did not ultimately need your personal attention, but in the stretch, this is exactly the type of situation you are compelled to deal with in person. Due to this, you do not take your place at Peter Gauss's table. Peter Gauss's great result by this appeasing him it may take more than mere fruit hamper. Well, a raging honorary banquet. Okay. 
Right. Run, Fancy Pansy. Get you home. The Empire. Because once this is built, I should be able to leave Uber's right to defend itself, and we'll focus on pushing it out, out of Altdorf. Remember, three turns till that's done. That's fine. Definitely get growth. Yeah. A true servant of Sigma. Right, how strong are Right, twenty two. So they're not amazingly strong compared to me. Yeah, I think we're just gonna start moving back through taking our ones. We are still very weak by the way, but yeah. We, we, we can't just sit Summon here and let Helberg do nothing, so. Um, it's fine for you to do nothing. Oh, is that a wee uprising? We wee middle wind uprising it is. Oh, unfortunately it's again to Marienburg. Oh, Marienburg are doing well. Look, they've retaken the, the pit um, and that coastline. I'm happy to see that. And Festus and Vlad are at war, so the more Vlad wastes against me, the more Festus might go for him, because he's the at war with just Vlad. Is that right? The sick. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, that might work in our favour. Um, now we can't afford to fix anything else. Do I need to manually move you? Yeah. Ready? Cool. Um, and my scout here. Sir. Let's Move. keep going. I just want to keep seeing what's happening. Your last mistake. Now what's this from Franken? Treat. 14. No, 31. So he's actually not much stronger than we are. Okay. No okay. Oh, bit of brand there. Looks like daisies. So yeah, I think um, we're gonna start a war with the Skaven too. Even though that is so many though. Or do I just go back and push a lot back? I actually don't know. I want to begin my war against Skaven, but What I'm really worried about is I'm worried that Vlad is just going to... Now, as is my right by um, we're just going to go to Uber's right just now. Vlad is just going to put yeah. all his army together and attack us at once. That's what we worried about because look he's recruiting just now. No. Sigma. Hmm. Moving out. Yes, it's a toughie. It's a toughie. Yes, Onwards. Mm. Gates are still intact, but yeah, West Coast is in a bit of bit of a shambles there. Sigmarite Arch Lecture. Yes. I mean, I could just keep building up an army here. Like nothing says I have to go and do whatever else is going on, you know. Ready. Definitely gonna grab them. And let's get a piece of artillery. Right, he's not moved, you haven't moved. Uh, I just want you to stay there for just now though. Just keep an eye on what's happening. God, Festus should be Emperor. He controls more seats than I do. Um, right, cool. Anyone willing to... Yes. Thank you. We will take it on aggression with you, my friend. The Warden of... Yes. Fair. Cool. 
So yeah, I think we just build up um, some more troops in Altdorf and then we move to push well back. But by putting walls around Uber's right, we've made it quite good. Oh, give me strength. Hmm. So he's just trying to stop me from raising more troops. Okay. In the name of Magnus. What? Okay. Your word is my command. I mean, our army is not good apart from Vlad. Yeah, I think we just fight a honk and stalk him back on. Yes, to your the provinces. This. Moving off. Okay. Who and get rid of that and attack. Fight for our right, nation. So obviously gonna fall back. I command here. I'll send Schwartz Helm in my stead. War to the provinces. Okay. All right, we've got a fight in our hands now. Yeah, let's do it. So, the Vargas are going to be uh, definitely a target of opportunity. I'm going to use these grenade launchers and just raid the shit out of them. Although, maybe actually just hold them back and wait until they're kind of blobbed up against me. One thing I do know is I'm... Oh, I would actually love to fight in that little nuke, but I don't think I can. Right, let's just pull back, see what he does. If he moves towards us, we run. <laughs> if he doesn't, we stand tall. Is he going to move against me? No. He's going to wait for his reinforcements. So we're going to do the same. But what we're going to do is... We're going to set up in between here. Like, he'll obviously send a flanking force around, but I've got nice deal there, right? So... And again, this could be a turning point war. Like this is this could be Grumberg retaking in um, the next turn potentially. I could probably just fast forward because neighbors are going to do anything until our reinforcements arrive. I might arrive earlier. Yes. Fractured away, but they do arrive earlier. Twenty seconds is no joke. Down here. They'll wait until they form up before they actually attack me. Which works for me. The Emperor has returned to defend his capital. When word reached him when he was in Pretoria, that his capital was under siege, he immediately force marched over an undisclosed amount of time because apparently we don't get years in this game or months or weeks, we just get turn times. Much to my annoyance. It has actually got to be one of my pet hates. Uh, or I was like, just give me an actual population, give me stakes, you know, give me, give me something I can kind of like you know, c create a story around, like. Okay, so they're getting ready, I think, for their push. 
Outriders! Albadiers! Yes, sir! Yeah, same. Albadiers! You guys. Body doggy. Nice. Artillery it can go here. I'm gonna keep you guys back just now because well actually no, tell why we're gonna stick him up front with um what's this face? With our witch hunter. Right, you just stay there I guess. Because I think you'll probably get buoyed. In fact, maybe just go back and help the cav. I wonder if they're gonna wait for me to attack them though. I don't think it will. But you know what they do, that's fine. Um, I'll move out and harass them into attacking me. They have no missile troops, so. And where, where, where are you guys out here? So what is so special about you guys? I mean, it's in 22, it's not bad. 22 shots. Okay. Right, let's just see if Vlad actually attacks us. If he does, my scheme works beautifully. Okay, he's moving to attack. Is he? Or is that his defensive position? I'm actually not too sure. Let's just move up anyway. It's not going to hurt us any. Um, and we'll just probably just move the artillery up into range, I guess. And just for because that's the thing, because of our artillery, he has to attack us. So, yeah, these guys can just stand back and prepare to fire and all that jazz. Um, where did I put my gutter? Oh, yeah, I put my gutter. Didn't notice they had two of our guys, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Right, um, let's speed this up a little bit because it's a bit shite, right? Yep. They're going to force this move up, that's fine. I mean, it's just mortars anyway. Nice. How does he keep making them disappear? Because he did that to, with his um, Vargas earlier. In that siege. Like, they just kind of... <laughs> they were coming, they were coming, and then they were coming. Unless that's like a new thing. But... And you cheat, maybe. Who knows? Right. Ready for war. Okay. So this is the first guy which is coming in. So I'm gonna get ready, and we are gonna try our hardest to bin him hard. Oh, that was, that was juicy. That was juicy. That was juicy. Right, pull back up. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no. Do, do not fire. That is not, not, not a target for you. You fool. Right, and you should probably get out of there too. To be fair. Hey right, Carl, just go around and finish him, please. Let me look him. Okay, you should most definitely get out of there. Right, on him. And then we will use... Send the cavalry to go and deal with that. 
Right, you guys on them. Just gonna hold the grenade launchers in reserve just now. We'll wait until they clump. And we'll start using our magic. Cool. Right, let's pull back. Yeah, let's pull back our gun gun lines here. Or I say our gun lines, you don't know. Shoot them! Take the ground! Right, go and help them. Where are you? You're there. Right, just keep destroying this. Let's get our mortars back here. Cool. Um, cavalry is going to act as a kind of like filler. So every time these guys like drop out of a position or whatever else. Right. Can you get him? And what we're going to do is we're going to get everyone to shoot. Apart from these guys. These guys get over here. Oh. <laughs> yeah, just um, run. Run, run, run. Right, Carl, come jump on him. I actually don't know what to do with him. Um, charge him, and then... Standing by. Ready for war. Prove to and yeah. Right, good, good. Right, that fight's nearly over. Oh yeah, I mean, we are absolutely smashing this. Don't really want to commit my knights like constantly. Oh! Sneaky, sneaky. A little bit worried about there's something up there, and you guys can just come over here and start, um, start pounding, start pounding. Um, Carl, probably just jump over here. Let's get some more magic from the go on this side. Yeah, it's not good. Don't want to be fighting these guys. Boys, shoot. That's quite funny. Uh, I did actually realize they had more up there. Go and help with that. You go and help there. Only you. Definitely winning this fight, albeit. Ugh. It's just like it's the worst fight for like my guys, really, isn't it? Like. Think about reforming over here. Ready for war. Moving now. Go. I will not stand idle. Very well. I'll do calls. Right, how are we doing over here? Right, cool. Oh, I can't because he's skeleton warriors. Right, go, go jump again because honestly, you're driving me nuts. Nice. Could we charge here? No doubt the skeletons will somehow push their way through, but you know. What can you do? Yeah, I think that's army losses. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. But don't get me wrong, like we, we took some casualties for sure in that, but that was um, a beautiful fight. 
that's put us in the offensive in the war now, um, as opposed to where we were at. And only Vlad has arrived, of course. Oh, it wasn't Vlad. It was this random necromancer. Maybe he did a man for it and stole um, Vlad's ring. Cool. Right, so, with that done... Um, I actually want Oleg to have the messenger, the if that is something that can be done. Camp 4, Camp 4. Yeah, uh, it's only really him that can get it. Oh, what about this dude? Um, can you get that? Oh, you can. Cool, right, we'll give it him. That gets his cafe movement speed up to 90%. Wound recovery time doesn't really matter. So we'll just stick it on these guys. Cool. Ah, oh, I'm here, I may as well yes. see what's crack a lacking. Cool. Um, okay, right, let's finish dealing with these guys here. I command here. They've got no army there, so we should, theoretically, be fine just to finish this off. Boost income for sure. What? Keep us in the green. Yes, my lord. We're gonna do that, and then probably keep the corruption down. What does the emperor be? Just check, make sure I'm definitely not gonna lose anything here. Ooh. Emperor's armor. Nice. Yes. Right. Um, I feel like the way in which I use him, I actually do need to get him some. Oh. Can't be a line of sight. Now nah, let's keep let's keep it down that way. So yeah, I think we're using him front line that much that we probably should give him some stuff. Right. Ready. You could probably do with. That to be fair. Summon the Carl, counts. you'll get your own stuff. Um, yeah, fifteen physical resistance would be good. Canvas armor, yep, we'll take that. I guess I'm quite high. Yeah, it's like eighteen percent. Cool. Right. Um, can't do anything there. The it is for the best. Start getting that. So if you are the leading their battles, probably moving yes. back a little bit. I just don't want them getting caught in position with them. Okay, we've got plenty. I think we get the next stage of artillery. Because that's going to be a game changer, particularly against the... them. Right. How close are we there? One away there. How much money are we making off the wine? Wow. 552. Oh, excuse me. I have no idea what that sounds like to you guys. So, um, yeah, apologies for that one. Go right in. Word not moved. So, with things looking up in this war, I think we are safe to. Well, there is two more armies here. They're undead, though. They're down a dozen. It's Vlad that's the problem, not them. And ironically, fighting is probably going to help our relations with these guys. Oh, I mean, well, yeah. So yeah, All right, time to start taking it back to Skaven, I think. Could get a cannon. I could get Kreinberg Great Swords. You know what? We are going to get the cannon. Because it's fun. Why not? It's a really random weapon, but... It. I've got a lot of archers going on here though, don't I? 
Okay. Right, let's Ready go and retake start. Montford. Now, we're not going to attack just yet, because what I want to do is I want to see if we can secure anything to do it. So, like, for example... Oh. The Warden of Sigma... No. Okay. So... My life for Tor. Yes. Have I not met these guys yet? No. Oh, oh so stupid. Okay, if we join one. Oh, that's really annoying. Right, well, I'm not waiting, so I just need to, to clear war on them. And start retaking this territory here. Pretty sure that's, um, yeah, it is iron, so we'll get rid of that in favour of the iron. I'm probably... Am I being crazy there? But I feel like iron's worth a fair bit. Ah, uh, no, nah, it's not worth that much to be fair. I'll probably just leave that there for just now. Praise be to Sigma. Oh, and do I get. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, but I get that on top of it. No, nah, okay. And right, um, we'll get our end. Right, you guys hold the line. And then train. True servant of Sigma. I quite like to get up, I can't afford it. To get that own army starting their turn in this region, so it's just that one region, not the province. That's just four percent local province. So we got stuff coming next turn. I think we just save our cash for just now. Um definitely growth and improved trade. Ferris was good, wasn't it? Eh. Not amazing. Yeah, we just hold fire just now. Right, so war's begun against the Skaven as well. But um, it had to happen. I see no other option. Uh, yeah. And they're turning there. Even a fortified impulse of power one. Vlad is back. Hail to Leon Core. How can the Empire oh, I appreciate your personal problems, Linker, but as king, do you not think you should probably deal with it? Cleanse the Empire. Like, I'm an emperor, and look at the shit I've got to deal with. This could fit into our faith thing, though, couldn't it? Because we don't have magic just now. The nation calls. I feel like they need it, though. Come, men, forward. Champion of the faith. Okay, we're gonna take that from there. Die, we get instant income from dies. From that. That. Um, let's go for die. Right. I will the no. So I don't think they could reach oh, us I'm in the next turn to actually attack. So I think we take Lumberg now. And the longer we leave right it, the longer they're going to build up, right? So. So, onwards. Bring me to my. So I serve. Yeah. We're just going to skip that one. Wasn't a particularly exciting battle. Alright, cool. Right, and that's right, Quint re secured as well. Which hasn't been too too bad. Let's get that going.
You know what, I'm going to get that just so I can get Gotrick and Felix. Um, they would be a big help in this battle, this war as well. In fact, if I can get Gotrick and Felix, it means I could move my army to Gotrick and Felix and he can go back to doing what he's meant to be doing. You know? Warrior right, so we know someone's there, but unfortunately I've only got one scout available just now and... Oh my god, I could have used yes. him to scout that. Righteous fury upon them. What a teat. What an absolute teat. By the comet. See what's Winner. down in this little nuke. Not much. I think it's doing alright. I wonder, right? If I do this. Wouldn't it be funny if I ambushed them? By Sigma. I command here. Boosting come, why not? Summon the elector counts. Yeah, summon them. Okay. Yes, my lord. Right. Um, just sit there until I decide what we're doing. We'll get that because um, the extra punishment would also be nice. And let's see if anyone wants to be uh expert. Speak. Prince oh, Elthar. Look at this, this is what we're looking for. Right, trade. We've got to trade with the dwarves. They look like they're almost done now. No glory. You have the warden's Trade with you. Do nice. Not in my father's name. Alario, I. All right. I am unstoppable. So he's happy to accept peace, but obviously we're not. So. Um, I don't really want to spend money doing a bit of anything on this side because, you know, we might just lose it to escape an attack or something, so. Kind of got everything going on there. Got that going on there. Yeah, screw it. Put it into that. Right. Next turn. The enemy failed to spot our ambush. Nice. Cool. You know what? We'll fight it because it's a bit of fun. Um, because it isn't even that strong an army. Oh, yes. Get in there, Helberg. Helborg. Because the thing is, he's not leading a terrible army. Like, not by any shape or form. It's not a great army either. Just trying to decide what the best way to do this is. Probably put the cannon over here so it's got like a queer arc of fire. They will 100% be attacking these guys. Yeah. Just shoot straight into him. I'm not going to attack the, the head of the column. Oh, I kind of need to because could they not escape? Yeah, I do need to attack the head of the call, don't I? Okay. Right, let's get like three here. Four here. And these guys gonna attack the head of the call, try and kill the main, main chief of Undo. Right, and attack. Right, you guys go hunt. You do your thing. Nice. And you can literally shoot at whatever you fancy. Like, right. it is your your thing to shoot at. Right, uh, where are you? Faith is your shield, so go get stuck in. Let's get some some faith good. Twenty five percent extra attack. Damage resisted. Again, let's not forget the Almighty. Nice. Oh, that's where their, their little retreating bit is, so let's go deal with that. Right. 
out of Sigma by the Twin Tail Comet. Ready! Sigma! Sigma! Alright, guys. Fine. Ready to fire! Oh, they nuked us! They nuked us! That is wild. Um, uh, just run. Like, uh, it's a summon. There's a witch we definitely could do. I quite frankly, you're not even really worth it. Just fight, so. I'll definitely need to put some magic in this army, like I can't not. <laughs> but I think that's what we'll finish the outdoor, so we might actually buy ourselves a wizard and send him over here anyway, because like imagine fire is up in this game and it's such it's so good, like stuff for just cleared out hordes and hordes of enemies, that's what I need. And I love these knights. Like, oh they're just a business. Look at them. Just a summon, so just keep moving. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't quite the stomp I was hoping it was going to be, but it's a, it's a relatively shit army. And, um, you know, it's Gaven, like, I mean, you just deleted two of my units of a nuke. Like, what can you do? Even at the hands of the game, it's Gaven never cheated his faction. It literally doesn't seem to be a, a way around it. That's fine. Makes for a more interesting battle, I guess. Now, I thought you guys could fire whilst moving. Oh, I can't. We're all gonna focus too much to kill that lord. Anyway, we need to just run them down. Nice. Like, I'm not necessarily trying to kill every last unit, I just wanted to try and weaken them a bit more, to be fair. Yeah, I mean, that'll do. That'll do. I can't believe they used that. Ugh. You know, I wonder what how it is with the Class Grier if they are going to get a nuke every turn. So is that something every single battle I need to be aware of? But I mean, there's not much I can do about it. I just need to kind of suck it up. That cannon was doing fine until it was ambushed. Take that. I mean, the good thing is, it's basically he's just run away. <laughs> You are not welcome in my court. I would actually, I would quite like to piece out of you, but I can't afford to, so. Your armies are pretty trash. God, why would the AI have done that? So Vlad has just moved his army into such a vulnerable position, which I'm delighted with. I don't understand it though. Like I'm not gonna lie. So it's come to the attention of another elector that you were a target of bribery many years ago, having taken a vast payment from the merchant guild early in your tenure. In return, you lobbied against tightening regulations in your businesses, and were not only head of the state, they were 
and you were not the only headache to, to ever done so. Still pretty dodgy, Carl. And um, we let her has proved proof of your acceptance as a merchant guild gold, although a minor blot on your past. He is threatened to reveal the evidence to the other electors unless you give him considerable compensation. Maybe ancient history, but the information will surely cause the other electors to question your character. Oh, excuse me, I'm placed amongst their number. Okay, arrange political favours. Yes, go trigger Felix. Construction time, uh, time or cost, that's what I need to look at. And uh, we just got a bunch of stuff. It is just time! Oh my god, it's not even cost. Like, I am such a spaz. Okay. Right, let's start focusing on our trade now. So we're gonna go for go for commodities first, and then we'll go for colonial factors. Again, I'm not too sure where which hunters, warrior priests. Okay. Right. Yeah, I don't like the fat he's here. Right, um, Elborg, let's just get you some bits and pieces. Sparing presence. Your word and if you want to push down and take Paravon. I'm actually okay with losing that one guy because I'd rather replace him with something better. So, yeah, I'll go with that. Oh, that's quite good. Because in fact, you know what, that's going to be a wizard, isn't it? Because I'm about to get that, so talking of wizards. Let's see what we've got. What kind of wizard would I like? Light, celestial. You know what though, if that stacks, you could actually get like four of them and Buildings could get built instantly. I feel like the Bright Wizard would be a good way to go. Yeah, it's gotta be a Bright Wizard. Again, Skaven. Yeah, for sure. Cool. So, yeah. You're gonna go and join Halberg's army. Get Burning Head and Kindle Flame. Awaiting orders. Halberg. Yeah, let's get actually let's get the missile troops first. These two guys good. I don't want you to have that. Uh, traded, yep. And just get your defense. Okay, we don't need that wouldn't actually hurt here. We don't need that one because we can't do anything with it until we're next level, but this would actually not hurt. Just because we don't know what will happen in this campaign, you know? Um, what's that? Oh, yeah. And he's heading down to go and support. He can get Goat Trick and Felix for us. I probably should read that, sorry to we'll say. make a slayer out of you yet, manling. The written word shall immortalize the horrors I have witnessed. Okay. So, recent conversation, local tavern has been centered around a pair of powerful mercenaries rumored to be traveling through nearby provinces. A famous dwarf slayer known as Gottrick Gurnison, his human companion and chronicler Felix Jaeger, some the Empire considered Gotrick and Felix to be outlaws, but a duo are known to have slain some of the other insurmountable adversaries known to the forces of order. Should they be persuaded to join your cause, they would truly be a formidable ally. Right. If you're going to fight, there is power a time to okay, heal. so Gotrick and Felix are going to head across. Um, Bring me to my men. This battle just doesn't the make any sense us. to me. We'll probably need to fight it to be fair. That's okay. Emperor, as is my right by Sigmar's crown. I'm not even going to take any casualties. Yeah, screw it. I'm dipping it all over. And we'll 
take money. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Step to it. Right, Carl's just gonna fall back into Grumberg and Is it time? keep doing up what he needs to do up. It's oh. get out of the way. So you need and withering. It's just our round your ship. You know, it doesn't actually say constant local effect. Oh no, it does. Local problems. Okay, yeah, we'll get that. And what we're gonna get for you? Let's get that. What does the emperor bid? Yes. Because I'm pretty sure that was problems, wasn't it, for the? Province for their buildings and yeah. Oh no, so it's local region for that one. So I do need to be ideally in Hauptdorf or Marienburg. Ooh, ooh, right. Um, we'll come back to that. Sigmarite Arch Lecter, Arch Lecter. Okay. So here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we move Federan round. Because. Oh. Got more income. Just now. But currently we've got 252. 504. It's a tradable increase as well. Income from trade tariffs will go up by another 10%. Yeah, I think we go for Murrayburg Port. Yeah, and we'll get more growth and more of this. And what we're going to do is we're just going to move him round and probably recruit some more troops. Not too sure what yet. Definitely get another one of them, maybe some knights. And the first one. Yes. Fine, right, what hero hasn't moved? Oh, that was something I need to do. Where is he? Right, can I just Your have a wee we move that down here. Move. So just the yes, wizard in there. Right here, or not moves you. So we know about Vlad just wasted his army. We know there's his ever army Get here. Off. I'll have your soul. Step to it. Okay, I'm gonna fall back because presumably Festus is. I mean, he's not even here. Now, something else that I was going to do was we got more movement range, so I just want to check and an see honor. if we can apply that to him. Hedge wizard, no. no. Okay, it's worth a try. Hey. Let's see. Ever vigilant. From his point of view, was there more I could add? Apprentice wizard. Sorry, and no. from a wizard. Yeah, we'll take Apprentice Wizard, Head Wizard, Messenger. I, I don't know if I want to waste Messenger or not, to be fair. Now, the Empire. Campaign line of sight. Hmm. Oh, maybe just save it and then. Oh, well, you could, we could put it on you, actually. Yeah. Right, cool. Um, right, the other thing that I want to do is for Summon Franz, let's get him the talisman of preservation. Well, that's quite good, actually. That's also quite good. Um, you know what? I'll no give you the, the icon before I forget. And then I think what we do is. 
Champion for Halberg, we give him Talisman of uh, Preservation. That's perfect for him. Um, and we can just give what orders? the Ogre Boy to Khabarov. Cool, right, let's see if we can trade with anyone again. What would you yep, have of We'll take it. What would you have the assured? I agree. Alariel the Radiant. Our trade should really be getting up there now. Yeah, trade's up to three grand. I agree that is really starting to come in. And we are about to get so we're about to get this, which will increase our commodities by nearly 10%, and then that's going to increase it by 10%, so that's going to be 20. And once he gets across, it'll be quite a bit. I think that's everything. He's healing, because he's going to take a couple of turns to heal, and then we'll have to wait for Felix to get up there anyway. Praise be to Sigma. True servant of Sigma. You know what? I'm going to rename him. Of the weak. Change out to that. Uh, and we're going to make him the Archwector. Oh. Jesus. Is that Wector or Wector? Yeah, I think it's Wector. Yeah, let's make him the Archwector. Strong builder is fine, and uh, yeah, and then he's just gonna basically pass his army over to Gotrick and Felix because we'll have them for thirty turns, which is plenty. Go. What I do really need though is, or what um, the Arcbat really needs is artillery. Like if we get just two Hellblaster, not Hellblaster volley guns, and. Um, Oh god, what are they called? Hellstorm batteries. If we get two of them, this game would really, really struggle. Even one, maybe two is a bit much, maybe two is a lot to protect against Gaven. Well, the Emperor's armies march forth, our nobles barter with each other, claiming great swabs of land for themselves. Should the common man be a brave soldier, not have a farmstead in which to retire? Well, obviously, um, they rule. Veterans got in present in regions during building construction, minus 5% building cost and income from all buildings. Local, so he'll be up to 25 now, won't he? And where is he? To the provinces. Oh. Might should be. But it's probably because it's a tree or something, I don't know. Yeah, well, I don't understand why that hasn't taken effect. Should be affecting at least one of them. Ah, oh, it's, it's a brand new one down there, that's fine. Okay. Alright, um. Ready. Let's swap over Is here. Vlad's coming back to our army. Carl's preparing for it. We're gonna just do a uh, hard swap here. And. Then we're going to keep continuing north to Marienburg. Worry about that in a second. That's all building. We quite like to get up to there, but. I will do anything for Sigma. And yeah. Sigma's will. Let's get. Why is it minus 40%? Oh, because I plague. Yeah, got a uh, marble. Got some stone. I think it's worth doing it for the Like I do. I mean, it's worth doing them all up, but yeah, I ain't for just so we can maybe get some walls in it. And keep it a bit better protected and then we'll use that money to get something else right, let's get a um, rocket battery yes, General. there's probably fine because I want to keep an eye on what's happening in this region it's not um, I'm not interested in what's going on so I'll be here just now yes, yep you can come in 
good. Do I attack him yes. this turn? You know what I could do actually. Let's go. I could try and ambush him. Yes, to unite the provinces. And let's look at diplomacy. Come on, more trade. Nah, not yet. Um, I will take military access Welcome. from Cassie Crap. Right. You bet. We must right. form an alliance. Me. I'm waiting. Right, so I feel like we're starting to get a grip of our situation now. Like, the, the opening salvo of the war was, was, was mixed, to be honest. I mean, we weakened one of the armies, but we took so much casualties, we've had to sit and replenish for like three turns, so. Sylvania, though, this part of the war has been going super well. Festus moving into work bad. Ambush foiled. Oh no! He sent an assassin. No. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Uh, let's get you into the standard stance. So we're 500 just now. Let's see how much this goes up. Okay, so it's gone it up 200, and that isn't even finished yet. So look at that. So that'll be 800 now. Yeah, we'll take that. Such insolence. No. You know what? Even without the magic, I think we can still win that. Thou art unfit to govern me. I think let's get a and let's just go go for it. Right, they're still building up, which is absolutely fine. We're just waiting on them here. We'll probably need one more turn just before we push on. I command here. Karienberg. We're gonna get that. Yeah. Now. And Carl's raging because his dude got assassinated, so we're going for it. I mean, we wouldn't just say somebody, but screw it. Oh, fuck that, one, we were. So, mostly our strategy in the war against Sylvania has just been attrition. It's just been to keep fingering our armies, which. Yeah. I mean, fighting a war of attrition against the dead is a bit stupid, but. Gotta play the hands I've got, you know? Right, I'm putting the guys, um, putting the Sigmar Sons and Carryberg Great Swords on one side. Now, the reason for that is because they don't break. So, well, it's quite obvious they won't break. Um, but what that allow me to do? Is not to worry about my flank and be able to develop alternative mix of attack. You go there. Should be fine about magic, to be fair. Cool. And yeah, let's move you guys forward. And the artillery is just going to open up. I wonder if they always look that good. Because they look awesome. Like that, that colour scheme and everything with the black armour, that's really, really good. Look out, spell. Yeah, if you just want to sit there and take it, be my guest. I'm not moving up. They can come to me, which they are now. Hmm. Not 
too sure why you're firing at N. You guys can maybe fire at Vlad. That would be pretty exceptional. Cool, wait until they volley. I wonder if Franz could just go up and take him out in the air, actually. Yeah, we'll bring him closer. We won't do it just yet, but... Right, and they're getting ready to move around our flanks. Um, as are... Yeah. Oh, they've got archers, so they do. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, Vlad, you are taking a pounding, my friend. Pull back. Um, just charge that. Oh, Vlad is almost done. He's doing well against that Vargeist. And um, not Vargeist, Terrorgeist. Oh, we were so close to getting him. Oh, that's so annoying. Like, we were literally so close. Maybe we just go and try and fight him. Um, yeah, they're winning here. It's fine. Could probably go jump again. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's back going well. I mean, I expect it to go well, to be fair. It had no right to go bad way. Come on, get him. Oh my god. Get him. Nice. Ever, dude. You're just fighting zombies. Nice. Vlad's dead. His whole army will just collapse then. Like, they'll have no leadership whatsoever. And we'll move the cavalry around. You guys back in there. There. That's it. Now we just fast forward, I guess. Nice. Yeah, Carl actually did okay there. The annoying thing is, like, we're so far into this, and I don't even have, like, I don't, I'm not a huge fan of my army just now, as Carl. I'm a little low. They've done some pretty good things, like, Infantry have held well, and I think the cost has allowed me to have more armies, which is good. I haven't actually come across an army I couldn't beat yet. So maybe I am stressing over nothing. Right, let's get. Dosh, I always want the Dosh. Increasing, we've got all these things now. Now, there's a really cool one Summon here that I actually counts. would love to get with Carl Franz. Um, yeah, we'll get that. Get that. Uh, no, we'll get tools of judgment um, and get the extra fit, you call it. Um, definitely an apprentice wizard. Casualties. They're all quite good. Let's get a wound recovery type. Oh, nope. Just got the exact same thing again. Apprentice Wizard. That should help when the guy comes back. We can't make it across here. there, sadly, but at right least we'll get our magic Sigma's back up. Crown. He's where he needs to be. 284. We're right, waiting one more turn with him. Trace up in here with four grand now. Mm-hmm. Let's get that one up. Do we get that? 
No, I don't think we need that anymore, to be honest. Um, I think the threat is passed. And then, yeah, we'll get that. And, um, yeah, we're just going to wait with you. Yes, Hero not moved. Move slightly Onward. east, just so we can see. Yeah, we've got another army there. Oh, yeah, and we'll have this guy to move as well, won't we? How should we proceed? Looks like the forces of good, um, the forces of order have done really well. Like, um, looks like the elves have totally secured off one now, which is good for us from a trade perspective and whatever else. Um, Ostenka and the Lizardmen have taken that. So, yeah, like, west wise, we're looking really healthy, to be fair. Let's see, can we get any more oh, trade yet? Can I no. Yes, King Lewin. All right. Cool. And, yeah, you got more trade for that. Yeah. Hmm. I'm just trying to think there's a way I can use my prestige to help me, but there's not really. I've got quite a lot of it back now. I mean, I could use it to improve relations between me and the other guys, but I mean, I think I've got. Oh, who's that? Oh, Balthasar Gelt, yes, we will take that. So Balthasar Gelt has suggested that the Golden Order join you in a confederation. Gold order are the order are an arm of the colleges of magic dedicated to the study of alchemy and lower metal. Our Supreme Patriarch, but oh you can Balthasar Gelt is fiercely intelligent and powerful battle wizard who has served the Empire well in the past. Should you accept this offer, he will join your ranks. Will you accept the Gold Order's offer? Yes, we will. Interestingly, we managed to gain a bunch. The Bell Disease, Birth by Grandpa Nurgle, or Alpha Spell, but he's super across the population. Cluster. Wow, okay. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I wondered how that happened. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Yes, to unite the provinces. Yeah. We're not going to talk about. Godrick, Gernishan. Right. Um. Your word is my command. Okay. Yeah. We're just gonna. We're just gonna move on. We're just gonna move on. Right. Ready um. Thing I am really worried about is. A scaven ambush here. No, need my warm token stash. I go where I am needed. Oh, that's that's a, that's a lot of a lot of donkeys. Yeah. Because uh, they were army immediately after this one, so. This will definitely put the scaven on the back foot, but it's, um, yeah. It's going to be a frustration for us, for sure. Jeez. So, they're obviously going to want to wait for the reinforcements, which is going to be kind of difficult for us to punish, because I don't really have the type of artillery. Although, they're lined up to fight us. Maybe it was wrong, actually. So, I think what we'll do is we'll, um... Trees can have a lot of cannons. Maybe we put the cannon on the left flank cavering, right? We're just trying to like spoon them off to that side. Um, they're probably just going to do a summon to get rid of the cannon anyway. And I'm not going to. Do I try to protect it? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. What I do know though is these. My little goon squad here. And the Archwetter are gonna dive in and make these guys order. wish they were never born. So I know that's happened. Okay, cool. And uh, these guys are just gonna sit by them, I guess. So yeah. Right, you guys just head out ahead. Same with these guys. They don't. I mean, it's a lot of slaves and just. Absolute rubbish. Don't have much magic reserve. I'm going to need to move into a uh, different stance. Um, 
Yeah, just move around their, their flanks. Like, we don't really need to engage them there. You know what, actually? One of you engages each of them. That'll be fine for me. Right, cool. Um, maybe just... Yep, stop there. And you could do that. Deleted. Take aim. Great cannon. Sigma guides us. For the comet ready. Nice. Of the Empire. Yes, sir. At speed. I cool. Right, um, let's actually you guys just go jump in there. I wanna break these guys off. Fine, they're deleting that. Those pebbles are a bit harsh, aren't they? Right, um yes, sir, fine. You're just gonna keep fingering them off. Where are you? I'm just gonna stay stationary. I don't think I'll matter, I think um even with that. We await your orders. Broken. Maybe it doesn't matter. Right, let's get everyone else in the position now. Because here comes the next army. Take position! Fine. Oh, I hate summons. Right, cool, we're still scaring all them off. Nice, and that's the end of them. And probably move you guys back now. Fine, and I mean, hammer the witches. I, I don't know what you actually want to shoot here. You guys are starting to piss me off with your summons. You really are. I haven't used any magic yet because I, I barely got any. <laughs> Kind of gonna let this last bit kind of clash and then, um, yeah. Should give up summon. Nice, right, where is my fire, please? Let's singe some rats. God, he's really taking out everyone, isn't he? Cool. Just get everyone there. Right there, pinning them down, it's fine. Right, um, on them, on them. The Empire endures. Fight them. Sigma calls. Take the ground. Understood. Yes, General. Sir. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Be fair. Be fair. Come on. I 
Ugh. Mm. Yeah. Right, go over here. Take position. Get Ready for war. For the yeah, I wanted them to kind of like come back because I'm gonna um, sneak over there and do what we need to do. So, because one of the armies wasn't part of the settlement so it doesn't necessarily mean that um by us doing oh that was a terrible charge by us uh, beating the garrison here doesn't necessarily mean that we will defeat what the reinforced army was which is why i'm just trying my hardest to kind of let them come back a little bit so i can inflict more casualties beautiful so glad they redid that fire. Like, how much better does that look, Curdy? Tell you what, though. Like, the front lines have taken some casualties. Forward, I guess. Um, you don't fire whilst you move, do you? No. Cool, and you guys can just go and be awesome. Oh, that should have, yeah. You know, it taps up to like 100 now. Kill the Grey Seer. They don't fit. Initiate. It's just him left. Because I think there's one more army like immediately after this for us to fight. Oh my god, that's ridiculous. Just. Like, surely the cavalry should just be, like, surrounding them and blocking them in. Let's try moving, like, away and then back again. You know what? I might take a hero out of the equation. Okay, well, ridiculous, isn't it? Just um, cut them off from being able to retreat and then hopefully let archers do some damage because um, this is taking forever and it's a bit ridiculous. And Creative Assembly wonders why everyone favours missile troops. Right, yeah, I think we did alright in that. I mean, we only took 260 casualties. Oh, there's a little lot to be fair. Um, we'll just occupy it. I think I'll, yeah, it's going to force both their armies back. 
The only thing is, they might actually attack me now. That is the only thing, and uh, there's nothing I can Champion do about that. Of the faith. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I could give him a Sunmaker. Instead of, like, him. Sigmarite Arch Lecter. Or the Black Wind War Wagon. I really, but I'm gonna put on Carl Francis. And think, yeah, let's get the that one. It's funny because I never actually use Regiment of Renown. I always save them as like I a reserve no force option. just in case. And um, yeah, you can just take that. And let's return it. Let's start getting the electric outs back into you. action here. Um, and yeah, we'll Only take all the goodies God off of you, my friend. As you say, sir. Yes, I never used to use oh, I will finish the sentence at some point. You stand today. before the king in the woods. Speak, and I shall consider your request. Ugh. Okay, we'll just get rid of the trade just now. Get him pale. Yes, I will. And then, I wonder how much it cost now. Ah, oh, more than you can do. But uh, a relationship with Boss over. No glory. Oh, defense Only of sons. allies. Yes. Ask no favors of Ulf One. It is ah, necessary. Good. Yes. Ah, si I thirst. Yeah, I bet you want peace. You dirty. <laughs> right. Um. He is still. Where is Where is Uben? I will explore here. Still going around, seeing who's who's who and who's what. Right, um, unfortunately we can't push any further with him, but I'm giving him like, one of the most powerful artillery pieces in the game. Can't do much more than that to help. These guys. It's, my magic is so crap though. Going for. Yeah. Alright, let's see how we're getting on here. Like that is just insane. So I mean, at that look at that—it's gonna be sixteen hundred once that's fully done. Um, yeah, we'll get transportation, proper roads and all that jazz. We will get do up Castle Bastone, and yeah, we'll just keep doing up um, Gotrix Army. I think another unit of. Out of curiosity, what is the difference between so one oh eight versus one oh eight, is that the same? Three eighty, three eighty. Ammunition twenty two. Ammunition twenty two. So you're always better with them then, aren't you? Because of mobility. Let's get that. And yeah, and then. Cool. Hey, you are doing something, you're just not doing anything. If that makes sense. And we'll go for. Income from trade tariffs, faction wide. Getting our four grand. Right, what a hero. Um, yeah, I just want you to keep an eye on things. Cool. So yeah, so the war in the east is going well. Blah. I mean, I don't know why Festus hasn't declared war on us. I'm guessing it's because he considers Vlad quite a, quite a threat. But I'm not too sure. Although I'd imagine Vlad is technically weaker than us at this point. I might be wrong, but I I don't think I am. Right. Um, okay, so Grumberg would now turn around. So Grumberg's now out to make enough money. 
Summon the elector counts. We're gonna move over here and get ready to move on. Warp out. Well, we're gonna give Warp Bad back to these guys, but right, uh, I'm not quite gonna do my building yet because there's not much point. Like you're always better wait until you kind of fought your battles and you've got all the necessary money. Because you you might make different decisions if you have enough money to do um, what you want to do. If that makes sense. Can I? Um, yes. Fine. Yeah. There's no diplomacy available. Wooin, you need to kick your ass into gear. Like this is just getting out of a joke now. I live to serve the emperor. Now that army is a lot better than the one we've been fighting. That is Ikit's army. True servant of Sigma. Protector of the weak. Weird that he hasn't attacked. I refuse. Praise be to Sigma. Purge the. Okay, so we lose four, so we're definitely fighting it. Taking it this artillery early on will be a deciding factor for sure. Our summons are going to be all over that though. But if the Arch Wetter um, can defeat Ikit here, that's going to really, really start pushing this game back. Where is our artillery? Ah, it's there. Right, can we see that? Right, let's not put stuff together. That's just kind of stupid if you're fighting this game. Stupid, stupid me. Um, let's get you guys into position. Because my hope is that we're going to wing this artillery duel quickly and efficiently. That is, that is my adamant hope. Probably keep the uh, cavalry a bit further back because I do not want them to. Right, guys, that is your one and only target just now. Come on. That's it. Come on, fire again. Ah, I managed to get a shot off. Right, um, I'm gonna change him to this, because. Right, you gotta come. Dave, drop that, run. Okay. Right, we're gonna go and engage them because it is like you don't want to just sit there and take it from it. If I'm being honest, like you definitely want to be. Look, they're already like absolutely pumping us with them um, shit here. So fight with magic. Right, death to Ikit. Death to Ikit. Right, back on them. Cavalry. Right, drop it. Run. How we doing, boys? Oh, that's, that is so brutal. That is so brutal. On your Hellstorm rocket batteries. We serve the Emperor. Missiles will fly. Get to faster. Right, um, how we doing? How we doing? How we doing? Awaiting your 
I don't actually know. We're, we're really not getting anywhere with Hickett here. And we haven't shut down that, um, that thing yet. Our cavalry over here is taking a bit of a hit. Yeah, I'm, I'm not loving that. Ah, move. Oh my god, like, just fucking die. Jesus. And shoot, um. Yeah, later. Oh my god, he's actually routed all my heroes. Yeah, this is looking a bit, bit, bit risky. Not gonna lie, right? Um, we need to like get into these guys somehow. Right, he's broken off. This is getting pretty tough, like, um... Shit. How did those guys get on me? Oh, this is super body. I didn't, I, I didn't realize it was, I mean, when I say I didn't realize this was gonna be as tough, I knew it was because of all the heroes. Cool. Um, how are you Attack. getting on? Kill that. All right, fall back. Go and help him. All right, shut down the artillery, so neither of us have artillery now. Yeah, this is sucking like um. Yeah, Ikit is really kind of got me in a bit of a pinch. I'm actually getting a little worried now. Should have just... Uh oh Come on. We need your soul fire. Ah, oh, you do not want to be fighting an assassin. Let's be fair right now. Cool. Right. Only assassin. He won't have much armor. Oh, no, we're going to end up losing him. Right, nice. Um, right, focus down, Ikit. You get out of there because you are so close to dying. You need to get the, the shit out of there as well. How are we doing over here? Fine. Right, all archers on a kit. Right. Right. Try and draw him off while we deal with everything else here. Oh, shoot. No, 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 no. Move back. My god, you guys are. Yeah, something else. So I have to say. I've just tried to buy myself some time. 
Right, it's great that you guys are all back, but you guys are literally no use to me anymore. I need you to um, fall back. And you guys to shoot there. Right, fine. These are the toughest storm vermin I've ever seen in my life. Go and help him. So, right, onto that plague priest, please. Right, Ickit's still chasing him, which is good. No, you guys just stay. Oh, what, what are you doing? You have no place in my field anymore. Just keep running. We are Sigma Nice. Can't run. Just go and get that guy. Oh, I don't know what that was, but I don't feel like it was good. Right, go ahead over there, because there was a chieftain over there. We're killing. Ah, he's there, he's there, he's there, he's there. <laughs> What's going on? Like, who even are you? Ugh. Yeah, I can't decide if that was the right thing for you to do or not. Yeah, that was good. Keep running, keep running, keep running. I cannot afford for you guys to get killed by then. Good, right, that's one down. Oh my god, this is an intense battle. Skaven are such a nightmare fight. Oi! Shoot. You wild little man. Like, I don't know why you were shooting at this, but. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I told you to get over here like a hundred times, like. Right, cool. right, um, no, you guys need to get back, and I want you to save your ammunition. Nice. Um, go and try and kill Ickit. Conditions acceptable. Awaiting your command. Cavalry ready. Charge. Yes, General. I don't think we'll get Ickit. I mean, we crippled his army, but our army's crippled again as well. Do your duty, men. It's front line just held so much better than I thought it was gonna. Um, it's just a uh, plague monks and stuff, I guess. I think it could have gone, is he? Yeah. Um, okay. Let's just. Um, we'll send the cavalry go and kill like, the last of this. Oh, it would have been nice to kill the Stormburn, but I don't think we'll get there in time. The important thing is we didn't actually lose our heroes. Which was a big deal because um, we were so Gold close to losing them. Oh, what a bloody, bloody battle! Yeah, those plague monks. It was, it's ironic, like um, getting outclassed infantry. Um, by escaping. That's the problem with me going kind of wider um, with the armies and stuff, is I'm just when I fight a bit more of an elite army my front line just can't hold it all. Cavalry did well though. Um, the artillery 
I'm gonna get rid of that hammer of the witch. Is that? It's just been a terrible, terrible weapon. I have had no success with it whatsoever. I mean, I might, I'll keep it for a little bit now, but um, yeah, it's, it's probably gonna go. Right, um, I defeated a quad. Oh, that's quite good. Um, okay, it's fine. Uh, oh, it's good. Good, good, but. Your word is my command. I think I'm gonna keep them on barbed horses. They're just better, like, um, I think, if I'm being honest, doing that. Right. I'm gonna fall well back. I'm actually gonna abandon Quinnells because I'm worried Ikit will just team up with the other one and think he's gonna finish me off. So yeah, we're gonna fall back further north. And like I said, it was not a good fight for us. Warrior of Sigma. See if there's anything worth getting. Edge wizard. Yeah. yeah, no, actually, I put that on our scout. Cool. Right, okay, so they've had to fall back because the battle was such a disaster. Your orders I'm gonna put that fairy man on you. Nice. What I might do though is he's got a weapon. I don't think he has anything weapon wise. No, I didn't really get anything. Alright. Right, he's still recruiting. He's just moved. Is he tired? What is that? He needs his infantry actually at this point. So. Could do it, Montford. Backstone post. I'm not investing a lot of money in Blackstone Post because, you know, it's I'm already at a reduction because of that, so I lose 30%, 30, buildings are 30% more expensive and income's already dropped by 50%. I will do it up, but it's not really a priority for me just now. Marienburg probably is, I think we'll keep that going. And the same with that. Cool. Right. Who hasn't moved? Oh, you're fine. That's okay. Hero's not moved. I'm guessing it's him. How should we proceed? I'm fine there because I just want to see what's happening. Vestas is the hard way to push it in though, isn't he? Um Yes my lord. Cool. And did I move him while I was there? Don't think so. I think it's probably just a residual order, yep. Sir? No, oh, I did move him. Cool. I think we're going to do one more turn and just sort of like finalize kind of like where we are. It's been a brutal one, right, for sure. This is why I fled Quinnells. I knew this was. Oh my god! <gasps> Derfu! You are amazing! Oh well, we've got to fight this. Like, oh my god, I can't actually believe this. Like, I. Oh! Yeah, let's watch Derfu just like stamp some rats. Yeah, Derfu's just become my favourite tree man. That is so cool, I'm so glad his army was there. Right, if this doesn't bring us close together, I don't know what will. So, um, yeah, what we need to do is just go over and sit here and hope. Derfu gets here. The only thing we'll need to be careful about, right, is that if if um, 
Because <laughs> my army is very weak, right? And if the Skaven get across here and kill me before that, um, we will definitely lose. So I'm just going to split up our forces a little bit. That way, hopefully, we're not going to find this before Derpy gets here. I'm hoping Ick it'll just wait, but no, he's not. See, he's going to hunt for me because he knows if he kills this army, he can win the battle without Derpy getting in it. So we're just going to hide <laughs> and hope Ick it doesn't find us all before Derpy gets here. Uh, don't shoot him. Oh, it's so tense. I just like, oh. Who would have promised they would come? Hide and seek us, is it? Come on. Nice. Here he comes, the man of the ever. Oh. <laughs> trying to be cinematic here. God, he's got quite a thematic army as well, doesn't he? It's like all trees and angry, angry branches. <laughs> nice. So Ickit's now gone, oh shit, and it's falling back. <laughs> um, cool, right. Let's go farm up then. Yeah, loving that. Right. Um, put it back, Margo, because it's going to take like a million years to march across here. But I love the fact Ickit was out like, searching for us again a second. Derfy came out, um, he's like, shit, I need to get back to my main army. Angry tree man. It's been a long time since I played a Wood Elf campaign. Oh, beautiful. Wood Elves are so cool. Right, let's go and help our, our elf friends here. Not sure they actually need it. <laughs> Alongside Durfu. Oh no, move! Oh, Eke! Falls of steel, Jesus. Oh my god, look at that damage! I wonder if Derfu's just going to come in and... No, Derfu's plan is to head that direction. Oh, he's sending that. He's sending unnamed tree man. Oh no, unnamed tree man doesn't care either. I would go and try and take him, but I actually think I'll get binned. <laughs> so we're just ignoring a kit, that's what's happening, is it? Are we literally just leaving her to die? Hey, we I can't leave her to die. Okay, 
Just give and smattering. A lot of wood elves died though here. Right. By to battle. I mean, obviously we're gonna win, but. Oh, like this is just begging for a spell. And look at the AI with a cheeky flank. Try to do the same here, but Skaven stops him. Then comes it. Imperial Troopers. Looks like they're focusing down the kit now. Right, get on him. And you guys go and help over here. I'm not sure if they're targeting the Warlock Master or what exactly they're doing. This is a never really good step in the war against Skaven. This is why I decided to fight Skaven, because we stood a good chance with the Wood Elves helping us. And if I had let the Wood Elves fall, I think this would have become um, our hardest front. And we just couldn't, we wouldn't manage to put the resources both in our east coast, um, our eastern front and here. Whereas this, the single army fighting alongside the widow, that's enough just to push them back. Ready for war. Yeah, just let the game run them down. Okay, I think we'll just end the battle because, um, yeah, they're not giving chase, so. Yeah, okay. So, Durfee must be an ambush stance because I never saw him and Wes, their turn was prior to Ickets. That's the only other thing I can think of. Right, um, and we get a bit of moolash off of that. Yeah, you better run. I wonder if the Arch Vector, because if we attack Ickit there, I oh, know, I don't know if that'll work. Okay, I'd love to just catch and destroy that army. Yeah, I see Vlad mobilizing because he's like, shit, I'm about to take work bad. I'll hand straight back to Sterling. Welcome, brothers, from across the Grey Mountain. Yeah, you keep asking me this, Lewin, but can't help you, son. Right, um, Durfu, Ambusher discovered. Rickard, you're back. Gave an air to me, bo nice. Red Grumney's beard. Right. Yeah. I command here. Right, I don't think I'm. Yeah. Right. I'm not gonna move and do stuff there because I feel like it's like the start of the next turn and there's a lot gonna go on here. Like. Champion of the. Oh, Durfu queened them out. So yeah, we'll probably I'll move them to Penel. Following Sigmar's path. Right. Um. Beast Slayer! There you come. Um, oh, actually, I'm going to move them up to the border. And ahead! And then start doing that. Carl. I'm going to leave Carl because we'll need to take work, bud. 
in the same turn, so I need to fight that battle. My order agrees. And sadly, oh, I can't really do it with the magic, what? so that's the only thing. Everything's kind of gold here now. Uh, I love my crossbowman, but I, I think um, they're the one to get rid of. Um, might mean his Prince army gets there, by the way. Right, that'll definitely mean his army gets there. As is my right by Sigmar's crown. Let's go. But that's okay, because um, I've got... Trek, coming. So yeah, alright, let's just kind of summarise where we're at. So basically, we have fought and won the war against... Um, Agreed to Skibs. We began our war against Skaven and it has been a bloody road since Montford. Montford went fine. We ambushed an army attacked there but suffered heavy casualties. Took Paravon but we suffered such heavy casualties between those two battles that we ended up um, having to stay there for about three turns. Then we finally marched into Quinell's and then had really bloody encounters here. So yeah, it's just it's been a bloodbath this war. Um, here, on the other hand, it's actually been really good. We've completed the uh, vampires attacked, tried to take Altdorf, we defended the city, and then we fought quite a major battle outside the city, pushed everyone back. Yeah. And now, kind of like, what's ahead of us? Like, we've restored Sterland, um, the elector electorate Sterland, um, got Trick and Felix Helm, we've got a full stack, so that'll be two stacks against them, and we've already been winning with one. Um, or 1.4. Uh, yeah, and we're ready to confederate Balthazar Gelt, who is winning against the ogres now. So when we do confederate him, we're going to get the holy seven bit and hopefully parts of that. I might just check and see diplomacy wise, just quickly if we can get Let's trade. No. Yeah. And trade wise, we're getting her. Like one more turn, and our trade goods are going up to up by eight percent. In terms of production, we're already at four grand. So, you know, if you look at building income, like that's like only two grand more just now than what our trade is. Which is nice, 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 nice. Cool. So, yeah, guys, I think I'm going to call it quits there for tonight. Now, my next stream isn't actually going to be uh, Warhammer, my next stream is going to be the new Star Trek um, Infinite game. Paradox is new. Well, I honestly feel like what they've done is they've just copy and pasted Stellaris on a new platform, changed some mechanics, and um, changed some models. So I did what anyone else would do. I spent money and bought it. Um, but yeah, on Sunday, we are going to be playing that and basically seeing how it is and just sort of. Like, I've never played it before, so this will be the first time ever that I've played it. So it'll be kind of walking through the game, seeing what it's like, um, looking at the mechanics, looking at the game functions, um, yeah, so feel free to join me, and that'll be what we're doing on Sunday, as far as coming back to our Empire stream, it'll probably be Monday or Tuesday, um, but I'll decide that on Sunday, um, but yeah, I'm just going to take the next couple of days off, finish your work tomorrow and um, I'm just going to chill for the next couple of days but look if you're watching this back on YouTube or whatever else thank you so much and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe I know it's really cringy saying that but I'm trying to create a channel so any help you can give me would be amazing and um, if you like your content that is of course and if there's anything like you want to see or any any comment troops you think you know you would want to see a campaign is there stuff you think i could do differently or whatever else feel free to leave them in the comments as well but anyway guys i think i'm going to call it there so um yeah i will see you all hopefully see some of you on sunday and um if not i will see the rest of you next time i put this up cheers guys